ICANN is a construction waste recycling company. We do a number of things like roll off containers, which are the dumpsters you would see at construction sites. Um, and we do a number of services that stem from that. So we take the materials in those containers, dump them out, and sort them for the recyclables here on our yard. So when you drive by, you might see you know, our office here and products out front. But in back, uh, our guys are doing the dirty job of pulling out recyclables and creating other products from them. So we crush concrete into aggregate and other material you might use on your driveway or for erosion control. Um, we grind mulch, uh, well pallets into mulch, and we color it different colors or it can be you know, bought naturally. Uh, we crush brick and do a number of assorted services uh, to create products from this material that would otherwise go in the landfill. You might see our containers around town. We have the big yellow roll-off containers. Most people refer to them as dumpsters. And they're out of different construction projects, whether they're residential projects, um, someone might be putting a roof on their house or doing an addition, cleaning up their yard. Uh, we work a lot with commercial companies doing apartment buildings, office buildings, and out on Fort Bragg quite a bit. And the workers there throw all of their waste into one container, so broken brick, excess concrete, block, cardboard, metal, all sorts of materials, um, and it's brought back to our facility. And we recycle out of that things like concrete, brick, block, metal, sheetrock, wood. Um, we get a lot of new shingles as well, which, are, which is a new product for us. So whereas we used to have to landfill that, uh, it's now been approved for us to take in new shingles and we grind them up and use them um, on roads. Uh, so whereas people might think that it'd be the big commercial jobs that give us a lot of our waste and that we make our products from, we do do a lot of residential service where people might be putting on a roof or doing an addition. ICANN started its roll-off service seven years ago, um, but our facility here has had a permit to recycle construction waste for two years. And we got into that, whereas we saw a lot of material going into the landfill. Uh, the landfill would try and keep recyclable materials out, but there was no really good way to do that. Uh, projects might go ahead and get a bunch of containers on site to put different materials in different bins, but then you're taking up a lot of space. Inevitably, someone's gonna put something in a container that they shouldn't, and now that material's been compromised and you know, might not have the value that it would. So we went ahead and permitted this facility where a job, a lot of jobs out on Fort Bragg who are seeking lead credit or just wanna recycle their waste, can throw everything into one container, and we'll bring it back here and recycle it for them. Uh, not only is our recycling rate much higher than everyone else's, right now we're recycling about 80% of what comes through our door, if not a little bit more, um, but they're also not having to think about it on site. You know, workers aren't contaminating different bins, and we're just assuring that the project really does recycle as much as it can. We've worked on a lot of projects out on Fort Bragg that are LEED certified. We've also worked on some that are not on Fort Bragg but are here in Fayetteville and the surrounding communities. Uh, we've done the roll-off container service and recycling for the new PWC building. Uh, we've done that service for the new Wachovia over on McPherson Church Road. And we're also just getting started on the new DSS building in Lumberton. So projects that are looking for LEED certification can easily you know, get their two points towards their LEED credit by getting the container through us and having us you know, assure them that we can definitely get out most of their recyclables. People's interest in recycling has really picked up and the, the growth of our green business here in Fayetteville has really proven that. Two years ago when I started to work here we had about 13, 14 employees and now we have 25, 26 employees so we've about doubled in size in the past two years and a lot of that comes from the community's interest and local builders interest and in making their product their projects green and it just proves that green business can be a sustainable and growing part of Fayetteville you know, Cumberland County and our community so whereas a lot of people are struggling right now business-wise People's interest in recycling has kept up and we've been allowed to, to grow by leaps and bounds, uh, giving the interest and you know, green practices. Our facility here is open to the public. Uh, we're located off 301 and people see a lot of large trucks coming through here, but we also service a lot of residents who might bring a pickup truck by or a trailer to come and pick up some of our green landscaping products for their home. We also have a bagger here on site. We have not started to bag products yet, but hope to do so by the fall. So even if you don't have a pickup truck or a trailer, you can stop on in and pick up a load of mulch or compost or other material that you might use in your own garden. 
uh, you just stop into our office and we can load you up with as much or as little as you want to go ahead and work in your yard. So when you come and pick up a product like mulch or compost on our yard, not only are you buying a green product, a locally produced product, you know, in your own region, but you're also paying about half of what you would if you went and bought it in all those tiny bags, which have to be trucked in from far away and then create waste with bags and the carbon that is burnt when the trucks have to bring that material here. Other products that we have here on site, we have ABC Crusher Run, which is a recycled product that people can use on their driveways or roads. Uh, we do produce an NCDOT approved material, so it is a high quality material that is just as good as what you'd get from the quarry, but it's a green product and locally produced. Uh, we also have mulch, natural mulch and colored mulch, compost, uh, we have erosion stone and, and other stone that you might use to, for drainage and things like that in your yard. In addition to that, to try and accommodate all types of landscaping, we do also carry products that are not recycled that we do not make here, like sand or river rock or some, some different quarry stone just to try and meet the need of whatever homeowners or businesses might stop by. ICANN is open from 7.30 to 5, Monday through Friday, and Saturday, 9 to 1. Uh, if you're going to be a little later than that, we often stay open to load folks up who might be getting off work, so just give us a ring. You can come and have your trailer or pickup truck loaded, or you can call and arrange delivery of products. We will deliver just about anywhere. So if you're interested in getting a container for your own home project, you can call us up and give us some simple information where the project's at, what you're doing, and how long you'd like the container for, and we can get you a price on container service that is the same as other people in town. However, you will get the knowledge that instead of going straight to the landfill with whatever you might put in it, we're first bringing it back to our facility to pull out the recyclables. For more information about ICANN, to see what our recycling percentage currently is, right now we're at about 84.5% recycling. To see our products, to learn more about our different services, you can go to getican.com.